artificial intelligence quickly advances, local law enforcement are warning the public about possible scammers. NBC 10's Rackenzie Jonikin spoke to one local police chief and has more details. Artificial intelligence has been a big topic lately, and though many are fascinated, there are also possible dangers to be aware of. I spoke to the Sterlington Police Chief who gave tips about what to look out for. Artificial intelligence is becoming a, uh, I mean, it is here, and it's a big thing that's going to affect our future more than what any of us probably even realize. Artificial intelligence is the imitation of human intelligence by machines. AI has contributed to many innovations and continues to advance. But could this programming enable scammers and cause a threat to society? We're we're quickly advancing, but I think now the advancement is now being used in a lot of different uh, wrong lights. We're going to have the people who uh, uh, will take advantage of that kind of thing to try to make money and take advantage of people who really aren't aware or on top of what this, this artificial intelligence thing can do. The one thing that I, I felt that we really need to make the public aware is the possibility, and not just possibility, it's actually happening, where uh, when you have a social media account and you're, and you're on, like a TikTok, Snapchat, anything where you're, where you're talking, where people can uh, uh, record your voice. Well, once your voice is recorded, it can be duplicated by AI. The Starleton Police Department warned people in a Facebook post about scammers using artificial intelligence to duplicate voices of family members and friends in order to call and ask for money. You know, for the most part, if someone's asking for money, you need to verify who they are. Even though the, the voice is them, everything's them, but you need to verify who they are. Chief Bunner also advised everyone to have a code word with family and friends to use as a tool of verification whenever communicating. We have to be aware that we're in a different age to where this AI uh, is way smarter than us. We're not on our game. We could be taken advantage of big time. Chief Bonner says the main point is to be proactive in situations like this and always stay aware. If you do become a victim of scammers, contact your local law enforcement. Reporting in the studio for your Arklamis News Source, I'm Rackenzie Jonikin. All right, thank you very much, Rick.